So the pediatrician at that point, she said, she told me to keep going on the one side, is get her to eat as much as I could on that side. And then she told me to pump the other side and just supplement with a uh, formula, whatever extra that she needed. Um, and then I want to say I kept trying for at least another week or so. And honestly, between like being alone, figuring out a new newborn, trying to breastfeed, trying to go through PA school, like I just couldn't do, I felt like I was trying to do everything and I couldn't do it all by myself. So at that point is when I decided to start just pumping exclusively because I like still really wanted to try and get the breast milk. And I had my, one of my um, ob gens actually, she was telling me about how one of her friends had pumped exclusively for six months. So I was like, all right, this might be easier for me to figure everything out with. So um, I started, I researched a lot about exclusively pumping and they really recommended like staying on it for a continuous schedule. So I think I, I started doing it like every three hours and I did it for... I want to say like 15 to 20 minutes total. And my the pump that I have, um, I could do both sides at once. So that was super helpful. After, you know, the 20 minutes was up and then I would put them in bags and put them in the fridge. I would keep like a supply of, I want to say three bottles of like milk ready for her. Because at that time it was like, we weren't feeding her on a schedule. It was kind of just like feed her every three hours or like if she needed to be feed her. So I wanted that supply um, available in the fridge. And then once I started getting a routine in place, I was, and of course I was starting to produce more because I was pumping so much and so regularly. Um, then I was able to start putting it in bags and putting them in the freezer and saving them for future use.